ventilation unit improves performance and reduces maintenance of your paranometer or pergeometer. The fixing screws, washers and hexagonal wrench are included in the ventilation unit box. Loosen the two knurled clamp screws and remove the cover before installation. The CVF4 uses two pairs of holes in the Solus 2 top mounting plate that are wider apart and further back than the unventilated radiometer holes. Mount the ventilation unit with the pen to the rear and ensure that the fixing screws are tight. Place the radiometer on the CVF4 base plate with the cable connector facing to the rear. It is important that the nylon shoulder washers are fitted to the fixing screws. Run in the screws loosely. Level the radiometer as before, tighten the two fixing screws and check that the radiometer level is still correct. Complete the mechanical installation by fitting the ventilation unit cover and hand tighten the two knurled clamp screws. The cables will be fitted later. Because the radiometer is higher when fitted to a ventilation unit, the shading balls need to be raised as shown. Adjust the rods to leave approximately 7 cm below the cross arm and tighten the set screws. 